good evening students once again a uh, wait an interesting and vital class for you i am going to discuss your class 10 mathematics of chapter polynomials as per your request as per your doubt here i am going to discuss one of the vital questions okay and you see the question here uh, the question in front of you look at the question find the value of k for which a minus tb is a factor of 8 to the power 4 minus 7 square is square plus 3 to the power 4 Hence, for the value of k, factorize 8 to the power 4 minus 7 a square b square plus k b to the power 4 completely. Here the polynomial is given, it is a, it is a polynomial of a. Here a is the variable. Okay? Understand? So here you can give the name of the polynomial. Understand? The polynomial of a p of a is equal to 8 to the power 4 minus 7 a square b square plus k to the power 4. And already it is known that it is given that a minus 3b is a factor of the given polynomial b. Since a minus tv is a factor, since a minus tv is a factor of polynomial p, okay. So you can equate a minus tv is equal to 0, then a is equal to 3b. And hence for a is equal to 3b, the value of the polynomial p of a must be equal to 0. Okay, as for the factor theorem, all of you know. That implies now 8 to the power 4 minus 7 a square b square plus k to the power 4 is equal to 0. Now you have to replace the value of a in place of, you have to replace the value of a, okay, understand, for a is equal to 3b. Now let's see, in place of a you can write 3b and it will be 3b equal to the power 4 minus 7 a square in place of a right 3b whole square a square plus kb to the power 4 is equal to 0 yes that implies 3 to the power 4 how much 81 b to the power 4 minus you see 3 raised square is 9 9 7 is 63 9 7 is 63 yes b square and b square will be b to the power 4 plus a b to the power 4 is equal to 0 right now tell me 81 minus 63, it is 11 minus 3, what? 8 and 7 minus 6, what? 1, 18 will be equal to 4 plus k will be equal to 4 is equal to 0. Then you can bring the common will be equal to 4 here, here will be equal to 4, here will be equal to 4, you will be 18 plus k is equal to 0. So that implies 18 plus k is equal to 0. That implies k is equal to minus 18. Thus we got the value of k is minus 18. Okay? And the first part, what is the value of k if a minus 3 is a factor of the polynomial p, where a is the variable. Understand? Is it clear? No doubt. And second part, you have to factorize the given polynomial. Okay? Understand? So let's proceed. Look at here. Now students, you already got the value of k is equal to minus 18. Okay? Now put in the value in place of k, you write minus 18. Now the given polynomial will be p of a, a to the power 4 minus 7, a square, a square. Okay, what value of p is minus 18? So I can write minus 18 to the power 4, right? Now you can factorize it, and you factorize it by middle term, getting matters. Understand? Now let's see what is the product. Is the coefficient of the first term and last term. Here coefficient of first term is what? Uh, the product is what? 1 and the last term is minus 18. So the product will be minus 18. And the middle term is what? In minus 7, which is the coefficient of middle term what? Minus 7. So minus 7 will be divided in two parts in such a manner that the product will be minus 18 and the sum will be minus 7. X for the middle term, which is minus 9. Plus 2. So you can write it 8 to the power 4 minus. So minus 7 is square is where you can write. Minus 9 a square b square plus 2 a square b square minus 18 will be the power 4. Okay. Then, then you bring the common here, it will be 8 to the power a square whole into a square minus 9 a square. Plus, again you can draw a 2 and 2, you can count. A square can be taken common. In the last two terms, you can write uh, it will be uh, a square minus 9 b square. Right? Understand? Look at note down. 
Okay? And again, you can make a common here 9 a square minus 9 b square. Here is a square minus 9 b square. Again, you can make the common. It will be a square minus 9 b square. Or it will be a square plus 2 b square. Is it clear? And again, you can a square minus 9 b square. You can write also a square a whole square minus 3 whole square. Or it will be a square plus 2 b square. Right? That implies a plus 3b whole into a minus 3b. Okay? Whole into a square plus 2b square. This is what you have to factorize the given polynomial after finding the value of k. And hence we got k is equal to minus 18. And the, the polynomial can write, hence we can write the polynomial of a is equal to a to the power 4 minus. 7s square b square yes plus minus 18 to the power minus 18 b to the power 4 and we will get the here a plus 3b whole into a minus 3b whole into a square plus 2b square understand this is the uh, okay complete factors of the given problem okay Understand? I hope you'll understand it. Just follow it. Okay. Thank you for your interest and for your doubt. I hope you must be clear your doubts. Okay. Thank you.